Hello everyone, the Philip Moisan here. In this video, I want to show you a feature of Skype, the chat uh, application. Um, what I want to show you is how to send a file and how to receive a file. So first, I'm going to send a file to my friend Don Ducharme. Uh, he just told me that it is ready. So, so I'm going to type sending, and then what I do is I click on the plus here, okay? So you can do a couple of things here. You can add people, but in this case I want to send a file. So I click on that. It opens uh, my Windows Explorer window. So uh, I just I will send them this file here, Skype commands.txt, and there, as you can see now, it shows me the name of the file, and the blue thing says that it's waiting to be received by Don. So Don, on the other hand, is probably seeing it. So in a couple of seconds, we should see him start to receiving it that <laughs> there you go well it's a short file so if it, if, it, if it had been a long file we would have seen uh, the evolution of it with a percentage I think but this one was very short so he received it and so it says file sent so I will tell him to send me one now well <laughs> okay actually Philip okay that's a zip file okay so well, I had a choice of course I can cancel it but I don't want to do that right now so we see the name of the, the name of the file. Uh, okay, the, how big it is? 252 bytes. It's a zip file. So and now it's waiting. So I click on Save As. Okay, and then I'm going to accept the file. Yeah, I'm going to click OK. And uh, there we go. I am uh, in the, the directory, whichever. I mean, you can choose the directory that you want to organize your, the things on your PC. So I said, well, it says enregistré, which is record. Oh, no, I mean uh, save in English. My PC is in French. So I click on enregistré to save it. And well, it was a little file, so it was done real fast. And uh, then you have, the, you have the choice. You can click on open file, or in my case, I prefer to click on show in folder. So I click on show in folder. And there you go. And uh, well, it highlights the file that uh, Don sent me, and I can do anything about it. Would I, I want with it, open it, delete it, uh, send it to someone else, uh, send it by email. I mean, the file is present on my PC now. Of course, uh, do it with people that you trust. So you don't want to receive uh, files that are corrupted or have a virus, worm, or any stuff like that. So, that's it. That's how it works to uh, send or receive a file. It's very useful. I mean, uh, I, I've th there are other chat... Uh, that allow to send files, but they're not as practical as this one. I love it. I love chat. I love Skype for chat. It's very uh, nice, very efficient, and I love it for sending files too. I mean, most of the time, if someone uh, tells me to send me a file through email, if I'm connected to the person on Skype, I say, no, 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 don't. We don't need to email. We will use Skype. It take a few seconds, and uh, well, if the file is very big, like uh, hundreds of megs, probably better to upload it on a site and the person can download it uh, through uh, the internet but uh, if a file is reasonably uh, uh, small like a few megs or uh, like a short video a few minutes of video then you can uh, I, I I say that it's not it's not it's okay to use uh, Skype to send the file okay bye bye